Good afternoon everyone, it's me Sam, your Les Ark reporter and I'm here, still in Les Ark, but despite the 100% convincing background, I'm not on the slopes of Les Ark, but at home in my house. Um, and that is because, like all civically minded people in France at the moment, I am on lockdown. So, I need to stay at home, essentially. Um, unfortunately, these exceptional circumstances in which we're living brought a sudden and abrupt end to the season, meaning the lifts closed on the 15th of March, um, which has been a shame, but it has been also an utterly necessary decision. Uh, however, being at home at the moment has given me the chance to reflect upon the winter that we've just had and, well, it's been a fantastic winter. By December we'd already had about a month's worth of snow, with snow falling from the middle of November, which gave us an absolutely bumper uh, Christmas period and New Year's. That was wonderful. January was a bit weird because January, normally very, very cold, Arctic conditions, whereas actually this year, lots of sun. And although it was cold enough, the snow didn't melt, um, it still wasn't freezing, freezing cold temperatures. So absolutely perfect for skiing and snowboarding. And because we had such a decent base layer at the time as well, you could go absolutely everywhere, all the lifts were open. In February, the snow came back, uh, lots of powder days in February throughout the school holidays. Um, sometimes there was a bit of flat light out there, but genuinely, when there's snow coming down, you're not going to complain. And that set us up for an absolutely great March, when the snow just kept coming. Unfortunately, as I say, that was brought to a, a, an early end. Um, but, that's as it is at the moment, unfortunately. Uh, it has been sunny and warm over the last few days and that has turned our thoughts to the summertime. Um, and in the summertime the lifts will hopefully reopen on time, uh, allowing all the walkers and the mountain bikers to get up the hill. And once again hopefully all the roads will be full of cyclists doing their thing. And around here the summer really is for cyclists. There are so many events, there are MTB events like the Arcadian, uh, Enduro 2 amongst others, they're up on the mountain and then on the roads you've got things like the Tour de l'Avenir which is for young riders, young internationally renowned riders, it was won by Egan Bernal once um, and the Tour de France once again is coming through Borg Saint Maurice so I absolutely cannot wait for that. Um, before the lockdown, I'd actually signed up for the Tour de Tarentaise, which is a, a local ride, um, a four day tour, uh, very cheap actually, and um, yeah, it's open invitation, so anybody can sign up for it. So I'd already started training for that, obviously can't at the moment, but that's fine. And that's the thing, you know, being locked down or in the house really makes you look forward to things happening in the future. Anyway, this is just a little goodbye from me to say that's the end of the winter. Um, it has been a genuine pleasure bringing you all the news from the snowy slopes of Les Arc, and I hope to see you again next season if I don't see you beforehand. I'll see you soon. Cheerio. 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 Cheerio! Cheerio!